Hi, I'm Jeff, and you want to know how to put the date in a cell in Microsoft Excel. Uh, now, there are actually two good functions for this, uh, one of which just gives you exactly what the date is right now, and the other of which gives you the specific date you're looking for. Uh, that way, you don't have to worry about uh, formatting issues. It knows what date you mean, and you can just format it however you need to. Uh, here, I've got a new document open. I'm going to put into this first cell a new function, always start function with equal sign, and then all caps, now, N-O-W, right now, and don't forget the parentheses afterwards, even though we're not putting anything in them, they're necessary for the function to work. Hit enter, and you can see that it's giving me the date right now. Uh, if you're wondering when we were filming this, here it is. Uh, now, you can also format this in other ways you need to. If I select that cell and right click, go to Format Cells, I can actually change the way the date appears. Uh, I can choose from all these different various formats for, for making numbers, uh, or I can put, type one in myself. You can see that M is for months, D is for days, Y for the year digits, and so on. Uh, if I just want the actual month and day and year, I can try this one right here, hit OK, and it does. Now, remember that the data in there is the actual date right now, but it's actually formatting it however I like. In another cell, I can use a different function. I'm going to try equals, and then we're going to go with date, all caps. And in these parentheses, uh, what you need is a year, a month, and a day. You can see that the tooltip is helping you out there. It tells you year, month, day. So I'll go ahead and type a uh, year of 1986, then a comma, then a month of four, that's April, then a comma, and then a date of two. And I'm going to put parentheses around that and hit enter. You can see that it gives me the right date. 4 to 1986. That's the uh, American way. If you want to go the other way, uh, European, go with a, a 2nd of April 1986, you can go right back in, right click there, format cells, and change the way it's written. Uh, there's all sorts of different ways to do it. You have all these lists you can choose from. And in fact, I have a reverse, the European way right here, 14th of March 01, gives me 2nd of April 86. I'm Jeff, and this is how to get the date into a cell in Microsoft Excel.